Welcome back. Halloween is six days away and COVID cases are at an all time high. Today, Rochester residents got creative to make holiday festivities happen safely. KTTZ's Savannah Kelly has the story. In spite of snowfall and below freezing temperatures. I think that's very Minnesotan of us saying we're going to have this no matter what the weather. The Christ United Methodist Church is still putting on its annual trunk or treat event. This was the first time we've done trunk or treat in a pandemic or a snowstorm. Organizers plan the event to be as safe as possible, with participants staying in their cars and volunteers practicing social distancing. We had our trunk set up on one side of the parking lot so people could drive through and stay in their cars. And then our youth volunteers brought a pre-packed bag of candy at the very end. So it's all the fun of trunk or treat with a little more safety and distancing. As you can see here behind me, cars are lining up on this snowy Minnesota Sunday to participate in a Rochester pre-Halloween tradition. What it says to me is that we're all so hungry to be able to connect and to pretend like life is somewhat normal. That means braving the weather to put a smile on kids' faces. This way kids can come out, they can see people dressed up and having fun. We can give them candy and uh, just greet them. Since the church has been holding virtual service due to the pandemic, Tracy Jones says today is a rare opportunity to see familiar faces. So seeing a lot of the kids that I haven't seen since March was a lot of fun, but also it's just fun to be dressed up like a chicken. Savannah Kelly, KTTC News.